I don't really have a one particular idol. Um, I like to read a lot and I, I take a lot from loads of different people in and out of the sport, but I wouldn't say there's really someone that I idolise. I feel uncomfortable sometimes when people say, oh, I'm, you're my idol and stuff like that. I don't think you should ever idolise another human being because we're just equal, you know, just the same. <laughs> I, you know, I train. That's how I originally came to Thailand two and a half years ago. Um, currently, I have an injury that keeps me from from training right now. But yeah, I mean, I know the I know the sport. You know, not as obviously it's it's native to Thailand, and I will never know it as as great as a as a native Thai person. But I respect. Right. For me personally, I was 106 kilos when I came to Thailand, and it helped me get as low as 80. I'm currently around 88, 89 now because I don't, I haven't trained in a while. But it was, it was a spiritual, mental, and physical awareness, and and Thai boxing helps to get you in really good shape. But it also mentally and, and, and physically fit, so you you know you you feel confident about yourself. Um, oddly enough, uh, Thai boxing, even though it's fighting. When you learn to fight, you don't want to fight. You want to save it for a ring, or you want to save it for, you know, uh, when you, if, you know, what, what a, a good friend of mine he told me he's a professional fighter, and he said, "Well, I get paid to fight, so I would never fight anybody for free. So anybody that fights, they should, if they, if, they, if they're going to be a professional fighter, they should 
use that in their head. Somebody picks a fight with you in a bar, so what? Walk away. Why fight for free? So Tiger Muay Thai and MMA, and that's important I say the MMA, Mixed Martial Arts, uh, is now become the largest uh, gym in Southeast Asia. Um, Southeast Asia. Yeah, and some people say the world. Thailand for sure, Southeast Asia is the moniker. We've had some magazines tout us as the largest in the world. We, we sit on uh, five and a half rye um, and we're, we're ever growing. I mean, so uh, with another facility uh, now open in Chiang Mai and with some affiliates around the world like Malaysia and Georgia in the U.S. and, and other affiliates coming. But what? Uh, Tiger was founded in 2003 and uh, so you've got a solid nine. Matter of fact, we're going to have our 10th year anniversary party uh, next year. Our communications uh, department is uh, working feverishly already and they're going to, our marketing group um, are going to do a phenomenal job. And I can't speak for the founder of Tiger Muay Thai, but I know that uh, he's, a, he was a he's a professional athlete, retired professional athlete, came out to Phuket originally just to teach English. He was just a teacher. And he was doing Muay Thai on the side just to get keep his fitness, to keep physically fit. And he, he fell in love with uh, Thai boxing and he said, you know what, I got to start a gym. And he, he went from one small little ring and one trainer who's still with us today. Crew Pet. Uh, he's he's uh, he's the uh, head trainer for all of Tiger Muay Thai. He's currently in Chiang Mai, but yeah, it's 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 an amazing story. It's a great great story. So our students are generally you find them from um, I, I don't know if you've been to our website www.tigermuaythai.com. Uh, we're probably the most comprehensive website in the Thai boxing industry, and that, that's what generates a lot. We have quite a bit of YouTube footage. Uh, like I said, MMA is one of the fastest growing sports in the world, and, be, and so a lot of our students come because they see us. Um, one, of our, one of our top names that comes here, his name is Brian Ebersol, and uh, he's a UFC professional fighter, and so he uses Muay Thai as a stand-up portion of his game. But that generates a lot of draw. Oh, since 2003? Wow. Oh, boy. Uh, you got me there. I, um, we probably, um, gosh, if I were to take a, and this is just a guess, I, yeah, I would say over 10,000 people have probably come through, if not more. We, yeah, we, uh, all of Europe, USA, Canada. Um, we got a big, big contingent from Australia. We got people from New Zealand. Um, I had a young lady from uh, Saipan. Saipan. Yeah, I've had, uh, we got Guam, uh, Philippines, uh, Korea. Youngest student, um, not including our Thai trainers' kids, an, an actual student that would come over with their family. Uh, we had a young man here, he was 13 years old. And I had a young man here come by himself, 16, and he's still, he's in Chiang Mai currently. And, uh, well, I'm 46, so, <laughs> no, we've had older, we've had older than me. Um, let's see, I would, I, yeah, I've had at least in the 70s. Yeah. It's fun for all. It's a very good, uh, oh, you want me to give you some names or, I'm, I mean, like, you know, well, first of all, by the way, a homegrown talent, Bo Kao. Bo Kao. Has he came? He came oh. through Tiger. Absolutely. Started here. Wow. You know, have you, oh, yeah. Know. Yeah. Bernung. Yeah. Wow. Started here. Wow. So, uh, but you know, if now bigger names in the world. I mean, I'm not saying they're not bigger names, but if you want like some UFC fighters, uh, Phil Baroni. Uh, we've had Mark Hunt here. We've had Brian Ebersol, Paul Daly. Uh, the list the list goes on and on and on and on, but we've had quite a few top line professional athletes. Well, we won't do it here. Uh, Tiger Tiger's ultimate goal really is to offer uh, a Muay Thai and MMA and fitness. We also uh, carry CrossFit, body fit conditioning, yoga, mental health, physical health. We, we just want to be a, a destination where people come and get 
the best physical and mental uh, training they can get and be that kind of all-encompassing gym but in an environment you know I mean Phuket I mean what the Hawaii of Thailand right so you, you get beautiful beautiful presence but you also have a place you can train hard and, and get great results sure so the general group training for one month is 10,000 baht it's equivalent to about 333 US dollars and that would give you yoga body fit Muay Buran Krabi Krabang we have a gym a weightlifting gym on the on campus with Peter uh, Peter the Thai Hulk he's always competing every year uh, never he's never been less than fifth uh, he was third last year in, in his competition uh, CrossFit um, and then of course what a, a majority of people come here for Muay Thai and then MMA training so um, that price I, I like to call our training in a sense a buffet of fitness you can just go to the menu and just pick 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 and you, you can get a uh, perfect example most people go to a gym at home one hour one hour a day three days a week so they would go 12 hours in a month you could do literally 12 hours of training in one or two days here so you can get a month's worth of physical conditioning in two days so the results are, are pretty amazing and astounding here. Right? Most of our guests come for about a month and they leave with some really good results. So we, with that said, we get quite a bit of repeat business. I mean, I, I've been here, like I said, two and a half years and I've seen people three, four, five, six times now. And I got people hitting me up all the time on social networks asking me, hey, I'm coming back, you know, uh, you know. Uh, this is what we call low season, so we're kind of we're at our low point. Uh, I think we're right about 200. 200. 200 people on campus. Yeah. Yeah. The, the, well, that's yeah. Boy, I tell you, it's, it's the the street here, so I tell you, it has definitely benefited from Tiger Muay Thai. Yeah. yeah. We're we're anticipating. I'm hoping for four to five hundred people in, in high season. Like I said, you know, so you, you've got a combination of, of, of guests. We like to say guests and, and student. Um, some people, again, come just for physical and mental clarity and just want to be, you know, fit. We, we get, a, yeah, do we, we get a lot of people that are inspired by Muay Thai and, uh, you know, uh, Thai boxing as a whole. So, the, yeah, they want to be professional fighters. So they come to Tiger Muay Thai and MMA to train. Um, obviously, you're going to have to have some, some gift and ability yourself. Uh, I, you know, a lot of times a guy will come train, I would say within six months he's gonna, he goes into Patong, maybe gets his first professional fight, sees how that goes, and then maybe works towards getting fights in China and, you know, in Europe and, and around the world. And, you know, you, you can be a, a Muay Thai professional in as, as quick as a month. And a seasoned guy that's really done a lot in the Muay Thai, I would say within two years. I'm Philippe Lauren. I'm the sales manager for Tiger Muay Thai and MMA. Please come out to our facilities here in Chalong, Phuket, Thailand. If you're a student wanting to just understand the, uh, we have the art of Muay Thai, or if you're a professional that wants to make their game uh, even better, I've got over 40, about 43 plus uh, professional Muay Thai trainers here on campus. We have a beginner ring, we have an intermediate ring, we have an advanced ring, and we have a professional fight ring. So we have a ring for anybody. Please come out, come see us. Love to have you at our Tiger Muay Thai and MMA.